The 2009 revision of the Y14-5 standard has added a chart that shows various datum features, their datum feature simulators, and the degrees of freedom that may be constrained when that feature is a primary datum feature on a regardless of material boundary basis. This series of tips illustrates each of these datum feature types using video clips from our computer-based training course. A sphere can only take away translations, and it takes away all three translations if it's called out as a primary datum feature. But it's free to rotate in any of the directions or about any of the axes. So when you use a sphere as a primary datum feature, it takes away the three translations. Be sure to check out other tips in this series to see how other datum features work or take our computer-based training online or on DVD. And remember, at Techies, GD&T rules. I'll see you next month.